what what my aunt and my grandma my, my grandfather as well as my maternal grandmother taught me shook me to the core of my soul i found that the mission schools had been teaching me lies about my people all along missionaries had told us as children that the only light came to africa with white people that before the white men came we black people had no idea about god we had no belief in a life after death and that our people were just a race of savages who used to lie around in the sun womanize fight and drink beer every day i was suddenly awakened to the fact that africa africans had in fact been far greater intellectually than the missionaries were were willing to give them credit for that like the white men we had astrology astronomy we had surgery in fact i found that zulu surgeons in the early years of the 19th century and the 18th century and even beyond could perform operations which white surgeons were not capable of operating and the more i learned about my people sir, the more i wanted to learn and when my my initiation under my aunt mine and my grandfather zigo had ended i wanted to know more and more and more and sometimes i had to pay a ghastly price in order to 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 gain this knowledge in one place here in the in the north western transvaal my my teachers found that i was really uncircumcised and they told me bluntly that if i wanted to be a member of this secret society i had to undergo circumcision and i did and it was screamingly painful i assure you because it was done with a clasp knife which somebody must have blunted a little bit just to make sure that i got the message well, I, i had the same done but i was i was asleep at the time so <laughs> <laughs> we have we have that in common and say in some